Guys, it's a beautiful day today and we're gonna read some I'm 14 and this is Deep. A subreddit that we haven't made a normal video on in ages, so I thought today was the day. There's gonna be a whole bunch to get through today. And yeah, let's sit back and cringe at some really terrible memes. Why Earthlings never use telepathy? Because they have a lot to hide from each other. <laughs> what does that even mean? <laughs> and also, what do you mean, why don't Earthlings use telepathy? We can't. <laughs> what do you mean? It's not even an option, is it? I'm pretty sure I can't read somebody's mind. That's what telepathy is, isn't it? Yeah, um, I don't know how to do that. Bro, Lion may be the king of the jungle, but the wolf never performs in circus. <laughs> wow, okay. <laughs> Thank you, bro. I really appreciate this motivational meme. I am an alpha wolf. You won't let this happen to your phone, then why do you let this happen with your mind? Yeah, this one, you know, is kinda true. At least it has a message behind it. You know, like, take care of your mental health, I suppose. But also, I definitely do let this happen to my phone. <laughs> All the time. Do you wanna fall in love? No? Why? Everything that falls breaks. <laughs> that is so cringe. And that's not even true, is it? Well, like, obviously that's not true. Something can fall and not break. Yeah, I just can't do it. <laughs> Falling in love would mean breaking. <laughs> I'm literally about to cry. This is so deep. Birthdays then. Look at all these presents. And everybody is super happy. Birthdays now. Look at all these notifications. Yeah, but you can still have a birthday party. <laughs> what do you mean? The notifications are just people that don't live with you or people that aren't actually with you that are wishing you a happy birthday. Am I wrong? But I don't think this is even very sad, is it? If you find a body and call the police first, I swear to God about me. I'm crazy. Get the frick over it. <laughs> if you're good at something, never do it for free. Well, like that one's kind of true, sort of, I suppose. I like my feelings like I like my arsenic. Midlife crisis at 15? Hey. Um, like I don't want to sit here and make fun of somebody that's literally 15. Because like, I feel like if I was 15 and somebody gave me a phone, you know, I'd write some pretty cringy stuff. I feel like this one's okay because everybody is cringy when they're 15. There's a fat tire and a load of tires on the trunk that none fit for it. This image reminds me of those who have many friends and the day you need one, no one can help. Yeah, very sad. <laughs> so deep, so sad, so incredible and emotional, I think I'm about to cry. There's a fat tire. I think they meant to say flat tire. How do you make a meme with a spelling mistake that obvious? <laughs> you know, like you wrote this out. Are they in that moment? much of a rush to post this meme. I know that says a fat tire and not flat tire, but I don't have time. In Japan, broken objects are often repaired with gold. Me in Japan? Oh, okay. So broken. <laughs> like, I feel bad laughing at stuff like this, but at the same time, how do you not? But also, like, I'm pretty sure this one is sarcastic, but... It could also not be sarcastic. I'm sort of hoping that they're not being serious. And also, I hope you're okay. Sounds like you need some wholesome memes. If you dig a little deeper, you'll discover that 90% of people lack a distinct personality. Everything they like, music, movies, literature, artwork, vacation spots, etc. It's what the general public deems to be current 
or trendy at the time. Yeah, but this is just like when we're on the not like the other girl subreddit. You know, like it's not good to also be like, oh, that's popular. You know, I automatically don't like it just because I'm different. You know, like that's not a personality either. But yeah, I don't know. I suppose they're right, kind of. But at the same time, it's not really that deep, is it? Like they're just talking about stuff that's popular. So yeah, but also no. <laughs> this is so real, especially in this generation. So what, a man is a Visa card and a woman is an FPOS machine? Yeah, wow, that's not totally sexist, is it? But also, like, is it especially in this generation? You can always find people that aren't like this. Yeah, I don't know, maybe a huge generalization? Flirt, when you fall for someone's words. Lust, when you fall for someone's beauty. Love, when you fall for someone's soul. Yeah, well, like, at least this one is cute. You know, like, it's not as cringy as the other ones. I feel like this one falls into that category of stuff that isn't cringe until you take a photo of it in, like, a real Tumblr-y sort of way. <laughs> and then, like, it becomes cringe. I'm selfish, impatient, and a little insecure. I make mistakes. I'm out of control at times. Hard to handle. But if you can't handle me at my worst, then you sure as hell don't deserve me at my best. I feel like he didn't say that. <laughs> like he probably did, but there are so many inspirational quote like photos on Instagram and stuff and they'll just chuck a photo of somebody on it and they didn't even say it. Why does pain feel so good? Wait, so this is a Steam profile and with black love hearts, dead inside, emo, drain, epileptic, paranoiac, toxic, bipolar, depressed, tilted, antisocial, sad, and broken. Um, <laughs> okay. <laughs> Just the toxic with a love heart next to it. <laughs> like, oh, ooh woo, I'm so toxic. <laughs> it's such a good trait. I love being a toxic person. I feel like this is one of those ones where they'll look back in like five years and they'll be like, wow, um, <laughs> I was a little bit cringe. Block on Facebook, done. Delete number from phone, done. Block on WhatsApp, done. Delete from heart, error. <laughs> and it's a picture of Groot. <laughs> like, why is that even there? Are they taking the piss? I can't tell if they're being serious or not. So much stuff on this subreddit could be completely joking and I'd have no idea. Hopefully they're just sort of taking the piss out of stuff like this, but at the same time, you never know. It's like the equivalent of putting a minion on there. He broke my heart into pieces. Now every pieces loves different boys. <laughs> What? <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh, this subreddit's hilarious. Eight planets, 204 countries, seven seas, 7,707 islands, seven and a half a billion people, and you're in love with someone who ignores you. <laughs> nice guys. I'm 14, and I'm a nice guy. This is me, outside, laughing, inside, sad. <laughs> I hope you're okay. You know, like, I don't mean to laugh, but it's so ridiculous. When I'm nice, you're disinterested. When I'm an a-hole, you're offended. Ah, <laughs> uh, I think it's time for some wholesome memes, guys. I feel like that's enough fake, deep, and edgy posts for today. Beware of the dog, and it's literally the cutest dog in existence. Like, oh, look out, he'll give you lots of cuddles. So sweet. Hi, Robert. Want to go berry picking? If other birds like doing that, I will go. Hmm, you don't have to do things just because others do it. I feel more bird-like if I do, though. Robert, you don't have to be more of anything. I like you just the way you are. So let's do what you like. Okay, we'll go bird watching and collect data. <laughs> ah, okay. That is so cute 
and so creative. Like, I would never have thought of something like this. Like, oh yeah, today I'm gonna write a little comic about a little cute bird that has a little cute robot bird friend. I love this, but I also love that attitude. Like, oh yeah, I woke up today and I'm gonna make this. Hell yeah. She knocked the little statue off so that she could be the statue. <laughs> That's so damn beautiful. I know I say it in like every video, but I love cats. I'm so happy they exist. A world without Chico? No. <laughs> oh, that was fun. I hope you had a good time today, guys. Thank you for watching once again. I really appreciate it. We'll have to do it again very, very soon. And yeah, as always, make sure you let me know down below what you thought. I always love reading the comments. And I'll go watch some Simpsons, I suppose. It's a beautiful day, and I hope you all have a beautiful day. And yeah, I'll see you next time. Okay, bye!